Yo, what's good? This Mastermind MMA, and this video is going to be my thoughts on Dana White saying he thinks he pushed Darren Till too fast. So, in the interview, in the sit down he did with Brett Akamoto of ESPN, uh, he talked about a lot of things, and one of those things he said was he think he pushed Darren Till too much. Brett asked him, uh, where would you like to see him at, middleweight or welterweight? And he was like, man, I just think Darren's at the drawing board right now. And he said, after the Cerrone fight, there's so much steam behind him, we just put him to the top. And maybe we fucked up when we did that. And honestly, I that 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 is kind of somewhat the case. But honestly, I feel like that's just the model of the UFC. You know what I mean? They're like, no matter what, like boom, like once you once you're once you prove you're elite, you're just fighting the most elite. And I feel like it's the beauty of it. Like there's no, well, you're more marketable, so we're not gonna make you fight Stephen Thompson. You know? They're like, all right, you're marketable. So we're going to make you fight Steven Thompson and we'll make it in Liverpool. Fucking Liverpool. But like the fact that the fact that um, he's saying he thinks he pushed him too fast. I don't think that's true because I feel like Darren Till has the skill set to maybe he's not fully rounded out in like the Jits game where he ha- he tapped to Darson Woodley, maybe in that aspect. But it's not like you matched him up against, matched him up against like Damian Maya or anyone like that. So it's like you you match them up with Wonder Boy, a striker versus strike bot, striker versus striker, a Muay Thai specialist in Darren Till, a karate specialist in Wonder Boy, and honestly you got a tactical chess match of a fight, but that was super high level striking, and and honestly like um he dropped Wonder Boy man um he dropped Masvidal. And he was looking real clean in the first round of the Masvidal fight. You know what I mean? So, he got caught. I, I feel like, I just feel like he got caught, man. I, I, maybe 170 is not for him, but I don't think, like, I don't think to be like, oh, uh, and, and Daniel Singh is going to match him up, like, better in the future and stuff. But I, I feel like Darren Till is not a guy that you, um, you just, you just fucking give him, like, like, ha- like, 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 like a Luke Rockhold, for example. Uh, how they gave like Luke David Branch, they're giving him Jan Blakovich at light heavyweight. Luke likes those warm up fights, but I feel like the UFC is not boxing, so you're not gonna get. You shouldn't be getting those warm up fights. You know what I mean? So I feel like I feel like just give him middleweight, give him someone in the top top like six, top seven, and see how he does. And I feel like I, it's not raps on Darren Till. I, I feel in no way, no way, shape, or form that Darren Till is done. Darren Till is overrated. I feel like he's still a super high level fight, super high level fighter, but he's just young, man. Like he might be like a year older than me or some shit like that, or like two years. Like, but he, he's really young. So, and he's young in the game. He's gonna keep learning. He's just got to, like, lick his wounds now and just learn from it. And and, and Darren Till's not done. I don't think you should slow him down matchup-wise. I feel like just another one, just kind of get him back in the dub column and just, just, just boom, back back to it. Like, like what you're doing with Izzy, Izzy Adesanya, you know what I mean? You just got to put them through that fire. It's birth by fire. So, I mean, you, you got burned a couple times. You just got to, like, let him heal up and just send him back in that fire. And I feel like Darren Darren Till has the skill set and the heart and the will to emerge through that fire. I just feel like that that's him as a fighter. You know what I mean? Like he 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 doesn't like he he had a lot of push behind him, but I don't think it was like it was fake in the sense of what he was talking because we, I, he meant what he was talking. You know what I mean? So I feel like the move for Till is middleweight. You know what I mean? And I feel like middleweight is where he could get back into his groove and like find more success and just like boom, be back to be like. Darren Till in the hype, but like you got a resurgence and like he went through more shit, more fights. He's more he's more more experienced in, in, in the fire of the high level elite top upper echelon of the UFC and he could start becoming a part of that. That's my thoughts, man. You already know it's Mastermind MMA.